right now in Dallas, desegregation is one of the biggest preoccupations that we've had in our city's history. Uh, I just wonder how long will the city suffer from this, or how long will it take to recover from the current uh, preoccupation that we have? Well, <clears throat> my feeling is that uh, there are organizations uh, which are devoted exclusively uh, to selectively racial issues. Uh, when when the issue is is very explicitly uh, a racial issue, uh, there are larger components. Uh, there's uh, there's the uh, the whole issue of of urban survival. Uh, the South still has time to deal with that. Uh, all of these things bear down, and uh, in in some cities with incredible, maddening weight on every individual in that city. So uh, we are preoccupied with race, but we are preoccupied with every race. Uh, we are preoccupied with uh, trying to point our finger to the specific uh, points on the agenda of Southern problems uh, that uh, describe a, a humane society uh, in, in which we all can live uh, as a as a community. Um, you ask, how long will we be preoccupied with uh, with racial divisions? And uh, I suppose we we always will be. You know, we're not going to succeed in creating a a real community in the South. And Southerners have always valued a sense of community, uh, a, a feeling of being touched by place, uh, and therefore caring for place and people. Uh, we're not going to achieve this kind of enriched and extended community until, uh, until we can pour light into, into some of these shadows through which we perceive each other, get to know each other better, uh, when we do, uh, we will not do it by the rate of, of asking blacks to uh, give up their self-respect, their culture, uh, nor by asking whites to give up their self-respect and their culture, uh, but by appreciating the wonderful, rich, interesting, terribly fascinating diversity of people in the South. Do you think we're through with politics of hate and fear and so forth in the South? Decidedly, yes, I do. Uh, for instance, and this really is, is a, a major, uh, has major historical meaning. Uh, we've had uh, groups of two or three Southern governors uh, who've had a, a, a fairly moderate position on uh, racial matters. Now, in this region, in the 11 states of the old Confederacy, plus Kentucky, uh, the score reads 9 to 3 uh, in favor of moderation.